Jim and I work a lot of shows, and wouldn't you say the number one question we get is about structure scan? One thing that we always hear is, oh, I have it. My screen doesn't look like that. I mean, they look at our um, demo files and, you know, with show pictures of rocks and submerged bridges and trees. The point that we always try to make is, yeah, it, structure scan is great for identifying different sorts of structure. Well, like, what we're doing out here today, I think, is an even better use of it, wouldn't you say? Yeah, definitely. Um... You know, we have a pretty flat bottom, no structure, sand and mud out here. We're using the structure scan to find the schools of fish. That's basically how we use it uh, here in the bay. When you have traditional sonar, whether it's ours or anyone else's, you're cutting a very small path underneath the boat where you can actually see fish. Structure scan, you can go up to 300 feet on either side of the boat. So you can see up to 600 feet. So now you're cutting a path through the water of visibility of 600 feet instead of 20 feet. So you've just increased your odds exponentially of finding fish in an environment like this. Looks like we got something on the screen here, so let's get the lines back in the water. Uh, Jimmy's got one. Yeah, Jimmy, nice fish. Oh yeah! There you go. Booyah! I like to do that. I call that my Kool-Aid set. <laughs> oh yeah! This guy feels like a bluefish. He's pecking away at it. That was a pretty good run right there. You know what? This is witching hour right now. You got the last light. We are on a pile of fish right now. We're probably not 300 yards off the shore. Jimmy's tight with a beautiful fish. We got some nice fish. It's a nice healthy fish, huh? Solid, yep. looks well fed. But Chris has got another one over to the other side. We'll get this guy back swimming. He already rose on the surface. Usually when the fish come up on the surface like that, it's a nicer fish. Guys, this right here is what you get if you use your electronics. You dial in the structure scan, you stay on top of the school, and you got a captain like Jimmy Old, and a good friend like Russ Stevens that help you learn the structure scan to put you on a school of fish to catch something like that. That is a beautiful fish, 25 to 30 pounds. All right, let's see if we can't find these fish again. I got a nice fresh eel. When you really dial in the screen, what's really cool about it is you can almost tell the size of the school you're on from looking at your marks on the screen. With a smaller fish, you're gonna have these smaller marks off to the side. Pearl. That's a nice fish there, huh? huh? Nice fish. I tell you, when this is the average fish you're catching on a given night, that's a great night. That most days you go out and catch two fish like this and you call it a great day.